Hey guys, how are you? All right, so we're using this die today, and this is from Frantic Stamper. It's the Easter Bonnet um, Basket die set, and um, it's really cute, but I'm not too sure it's going to work. I'll show you why. Um, if it does, it'll be great, but we'll see. All right, so you have to purchase these little cups, right? They have little lids. That's all fine and dandy. And then you cut this. I was thinking it would slide through there, but it won't. Um, I was thinking all kinds of things, but it won't. <laughs> um, so what we're going to do is we're going to make it a little bit different than what I originally thought. Um, so we are going to open. Uh, these are the Starburst jelly beans. These are all strawberry. So we are going to cut a corner of those on there. And... Just going to feel that. All right. So then we seal that. That part's done. That part's fine. All right. So I'm assuming the only way to do it that I have found so far is to glue it to this, which is a huge mess. And then this goes on top of here. So I'll just go ahead and do that and show you what I'm talking about. Um, I would planned on <laughs> mailing these. I was going to make them tonight and mail them all out tomorrow to some of you guys. But I don't think these are mailable um, as like I thought. They, I guess these are something that would be hand, more hand-delivered. Um, so this is really cute. So you put this on top. I do like that. Um... And then, like I said, I guess you glue around here. Where is the glue? I'm always losing the glue. Always losing the glue. Okay. So, you know what? I think I'm going to do the other part first. Um, before we glue it on here. So, it comes with this strip, a couple flowers, and a leaf, and a bow. Um, so, I'm going to go ahead. It comes with this, but then this is too short to go all the way around, so I'm not really sure about that. I don't know what that does. I know if you turn it into a basket, it could go this way, but then you can't use the lid, so it would be like this and this. Okay, so that's fine, and that's cute, but I don't know. I don't know. It's driving me crazy. Okay, so I'll go ahead... I'm just going to cut this. I know it's a little bit long. This is the taffeta ribbon um, in the color Mellow Mambo. Same color as the cardstock from Stampin' Up. And I'm not, I don't think anyway, that I'm going to glue. I might. Um, I don't think I'm going to glue the ribbon on. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> All right, huge bow. Let's bring that down a little bit. Okay. All right. That's still big, still big. I think you just need kind of a small bow going there. How big is that? Okay. Alright, so let's try that. And we'll just snip and snip. Still probably a little bit long, so snip. Snip some more. Okay. So I really think that I want to just leave that kind of loosey goosey, I believe. At this point anyway. Alright. So now let's go ahead and glue this part. We may end up ditching the ribbon. I don't know. We'll see. Um, it doesn't, I think the problem with the glue is it doesn't have too much of a surface to really glue it down. Because the way the lids are made, they're like, I don't know, this is the only part that's a little bit smooth. This part, you hear it, it's like gritty or something. So, I don't know. I just, I'm out of frame. I'm very sorry. Good gracious. Um, so, I can't pick it up now, but um, let me just kind of 
tilt it up. You see that sort of? I don't know. Anyway, um, I'm going to go back on there. All right, so then we're going to add our flower centers. Um, I just cut, I cut several different colors because I wasn't sure. Uh, but I think this orange will work with the pink. I was going to do the blue, but then I kind of changed my mind. So I put it out with the yellow, I mean the orange, and that seems to be a better combination. But anyway, I was <laughs> literally like going to make a bunch of these. And now I don't really have another treat idea. I do, well, I have the little nuggets. I might could use that, but... That wasn't exactly what I was hoping for, but so we could do them here and here possibly. Um, I was planning on doing them on the side, but since the bow's on the side, I thought I could just do them there. I don't know. Maybe that color on color is not going to work very well. The storm, I think, has passed us by. The only thing, well, basically, we lost TV, and it's still out, and, um, and Wi-Fi. So that was a bummer, but I, I still have, I'm on AT&T, so I still have, like, the phone or internet through my phone, so it's okay. But um, I just can't upload videos, which is a bummer, because I just did, too. Um, but I can upload them tomorrow, so it's fine. It's not a total loss or anything. I don't know. So maybe I'll stick these on here. Kind of on the front. I guess. And that will actually... Hmm. That might just secure that bow a little bit too. If it kind of glues down enough. Possibly. Never thought of that. But that's a bonus. A plus. Okay. I'm going to put that there and there. Just kind of let it rest on the ribbon, I believe. And then, I don't know. I'm going to kind of stick this down straight in the middle. I'll put a little on the leaves, these two anyway, and see if, see if that can just sort of sneak in there somehow. And then we just sort of press that as I get glue all over me. Um, and then there's these two little bows that it comes with. Um, you know what? I could get an orange bow from over here. I could do that. And I can almost layer pink on it. Okay, let's do that. So, kind of like those layered word dies, um, we're kind of going to have a layered bow die. And if you scoot it down, you can pretty much make any layered word die have a shadow without paying all that money for the shadows. I love those dies. But, since I already have a lot of the, the word dies, I don't necessarily want to pay for those, so. I think I have a couple, but not many. All right. All right, guys. So that is it. Um, I mean, it's cute, but it's just not super mailable. And it's not exactly what I thought. So let me try to pick it up here and show you guys. Can you see it there? Let me try to move it. I'll pick it up here. Okay. All right. There it is. Can you? Ooh, I'm afraid. <laughs> Can you see that? It is pretty cute, but I don't really know if it looks like a little Easter bonnet exactly. Still, still working on that. Um, I think, I don't know. If you added this, it could be the basket. That might actually be cuter. It kind of looks like a birthday cake. I don't know. What do you guys think about if we added that instead but it's actually supposed to go the other way and supposed to be open with no lid if you do the basket from what i've seen online but yeah i don't know let me
me know what you guys think. I'm going to keep playing around with it. I'll let you know what I come up with. All right. Bye, guys.